table. And she's the author of the book, both the sign book and gave it to me. You know, uh, and, and so she goes to the hospital with congested heart failure. Not only really that, everything was struggling. The daughter called me and said, you know, uh, Mom wants to see you. I said, where are you? She said, we're in the hospital right now. I said, I'm on my way. So we get up and I go to the hospital and I find her and, 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 and the nurses come and get ready to do whatever they do. And the daughter says, no, you, you got to step out for a moment. <laughs> she said, now, can go ahead and pray. So they lay hands on the stomach area and, and, and begin to pray and command in Jesus' name. Because the Bible said that we can make commands in the name of Jesus. Amen. Not that you can move God because you command Because whatever as a son or daughter that you commanded already is in heaven. That was all right. yeah. And so what we're doing, we're establishing on the earth and we speak with our yeah. mouth. Yeah. And so once I began to command her, she grabbed my hand and put it on the right side of her head. Mm-hmm. And when I put she put my hand on the right side of her head, she said a black entity does. Not that all the men are locked up, because all the men are not locked up. 
But it's the women that usually initiate the blessings of God. And the men catch on later. <laughs> Why? Because it's usually the women that are in the presence of God. I don't think it's crazy that it's women that birth and not men. It's women that releases miracles. Men initiate, but women usually uh, release it. Men can get something from God, but they'll hold on to it. And, and God, I mean, I'm, I'm a witness of it because, you know, at one point in time, it just happened in my life. God give me something, and I would talk about it, but I wouldn't release it. I would birth it. You hear what I'm saying? But you learn to birth it. And so we got churches that are filled up with women because it's the women that really are here and have been obedient to God. And you might get a man that, you know, we've been made with the glory of God. Amen. And women are the glory of the men. And you might get a man that actually is in the, in the, in the spotlight, so to speak. But look behind him and see who's pushing him. Look into his prayer rooms and see who's in the prayer rooms. They're all women. They're birthing that anointing. They're protecting that anointing around him. It's the women. It's the daughters of Abraham. And that's who you are. You're daughters of Abraham, baby. And daughters actually birth. Daughters are the ones that bring birth. Daughters are the ones that bring life. You hear what I'm saying? Yeah. It's, it's daughters. It's this daughter. When, when, when in the Bible, when men did not want to go to the front, God said, I'm using a woman. And she'll be the Lord. Isn't that right? That's right. We're still in that era. That women are being obedient to God because men are not being. Now, I'm, I'm talking to John Trumps. But it's women. Have you noticed that the bride is not a man, it's a woman? <laughs> Isn't that right? It's a woman. God don't have a big son. We do. It's women that say, let's go pray. Now, because it's women that does all this, the devil knows it's women. So the devil attacks the woman. You hear what I'm saying? And that's why the woman really has to be really sensitive and really spiritual to the things of God, to the word of God. And if God has placed a man over her head, then she really has to submit and push it. And push it. Because as she's pushing him, understand she's right there with him. Because she can't push him from a fault because he can't touch him. She's pushing him from close. And as she pushes him, as he goes, she goes. But the devil will have her to believe that you don't have to push him because he, he's getting all your glory. And all she got to read in, in, in Bible, in the book of Corinthians, what, what, in the first place, I am his glory. Is that right? And the man is God's glory. So if he does get the glory, glory to God. Glory to God. <laughs> and keep pushing. Just keep pushing. And watch what God does with you. You have more work than you can.